Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm the Mama Set. This is Violet Burst of FDL, and I can't be bothered to have win sit this fight out. That's a laser. That's a single thing. We've got a single la single blaster. That's a beam. They've got. I've got two shields. They can't hurt me. But because of their defense drone and two points of shields, it's still taken me a very very long time to hurt them. And it's simply just not worth um, me wasting my missiles on trying to kill them. So we're going somewhere else. Okay, that was just a texting kick. Let's see what this distress beacon yields. Some fuel wouldn't be too bad, since we're only down to eat. Beacon was a trap. A single heavy shot, single ion, boarding party. Eat space. Yeah, they always seem to go up there. Let him deal with that. Ooh. And yeah, okay, we're good from in terms of damage. That's a member of their crew dead. Now it's a case of just, you know, killing them all. Save my missiles. We wasted far too many on the last ship that we faced. So, alright, so quite a bit of burst behind that. Let's uh, take their guns out. I don't know if it's worth me doing that or not, actually, now I think about it. Maybe worth me taking their shields down or something, because in doing that, I get less experience points from having to fend off their attacks. Because I could always use it more things from the defense and the... Uh, the evasion and the shield drops and the rest of it levels up my crew. Or are my crew leveling up? We're getting there. Power up, trying to escape. No, no, you're not. FTL delayed because you don't have a pilot. So my gun is about to level up. 10% faster recharge. Um, except they often get a repair arm as an augment. Yes. <laughs> That's worth an amazing amount. So the repair arm reduces my scrap collection by a little bit, but repairs my hull every single time I make a little bit around. That's amazing. That's a really, really good reward for accepting their surrender. So I'm quite happy I did that. I already know there's not a shop there. Um, I was thinking about going down the bottom. Looks like we're heading up top to see if we can find a shop. Because we've got plenty of scrap. I want to spend it. Uh, the Lanius is shooting at us again. And they've dropped some kind of... They've locked all the doors. Oh, that's um potentially fun. Um, if you can set up some kind of boarding party. But then your boarding party get trapped. So, oh. Yeah, you missed. I, on the other hand, won't. Gunner leveled up. Fine. I wonder what that type of bomb is. Let's, um... Well, I missed with it again. Four fuel, eight missiles, 16 scrap. Hmm... Yes, I will take that, mostly because I just, before I got here, I said, oh, I could really do with some fuel. So, getting some fuel is a really good thing. Blew large chunks of your ship off. A shop! We're heading there. 112 scrap is pretty nice. So, it's a Lanius shop. Everything must go. What have we got? Basic ion blaster. Hmm, not too bad. A hull laser. We quite well with one of those. Burst laser. You fire... Charge power to charge eleven shots two. You do so an extra three seconds worth of charging time for a chance to do extra damage. You also just look more awesome. Page two. Crew teleporter. Ooh, reconstructive teleport's quite nice if you want to go that way. Um I am very tempted to spend money swapping in a med bay. Let's uh, get my hull fixed. So yeah, okay, if we get that, which is an extra little weapon that we can tag on, and it'll do an extra bit, a little bit of damage. So I'll take that, and I think I'll probably sit without the med bay for now. I don't think we necessarily need to give by anything else, but what I can do is go to the ship and upgrade those two so that we can now start having firing ions, which will just put an extra bit of damage out. I mean, it's not the most fastest firing bit of kit in the world. 
our little ion bars, but every seven, eight seconds it will fire and it will do just that little bit more damage and cause that little bit more havoc to our enemy. So, thank you very much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. This has been, as my phone is so aptly reminding, a five minute burst of FDL. This is season four with the Tektite. Yeah, I think we're doing okay so far. It'll probably all go horribly wrong later on when it discovers I haven't upgraded enough things in the right order, but we'll find out. Keeping our eyes open for a cloaking device so we can try and avoid more damage in the later fights. But other than that, thank you very much for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe.